something a little bit different for you. Ladies, um, I have some blocks here. Whoa! Yeah. Get it, get it, there it is. Okay, and what I want you to do is I want you to begin to put together the scripture for me facing that way so that we can see. It's Hebrews 10 and 24. Do you think you can do that, Anya? I need a whole so, one. You need what? A whole one. What? A whole one. We're, we got to put them together. Hebrews 10 and 24. 10 and 24 is what I meant to say. I hope I said that right. So anyway, while you put that together, I'm going to go ahead and tell the folks at home, the Lambies, a little story. Oh. So have you ever heard the What's story? What's the scripture? Hebrews 10 and 24, remember? Let What's us, the verse? Let us consider how we can spur each other Matching. towards love and consider. good deeds. There you go. Ah, get out of the... Uh, there we let go. us consider how, how we can how. spur each other I need the how are you. She needs those to put the thing together. There you go. Okay. There you go. Good. Okay. So while she's putting that all together, yeah, you're going to need a lot of room. There we go. Going to need a lot of room. Hopefully she's going to get that right. It's okay. We'll, we'll, we'll figure it out. Keep going. So anyhow, while she's putting that together, I'm going to tell you guys a story at home. So do you know the story of King David and a man named Mephibosheth? Can you guys say that? Say Mephibosheth. It. There you go. That was pretty good, actually. Can you say it? Mephibosheth. Mephibosheth. That's right. It was right. one of our lessons. It was one of our lessons here in kids' ministry. That's why I want to tell the kids at home. So David was the king, right? And here's what happened. Saul was gone, and his son, Jonathan, who was David's very best of friend, was also gone. They both had died, right? So David, now that he was the king, so what they used to do back in Israel in, in those times, well, actually just about anywhere, what they used to do was kill everybody in the whole family after the king's gone. Done. So nobody can ever rise up and try to take power. So everybody expected David to do that. David didn't do that. Did you know that? He didn't do that. Actually, what he did was he went and found Jonathan's son, whose name was... Mephibosheth. Mephibosheth, that's right. A complicating name ever. It was a very complicated name, yes. He went and found him. Now, now Mephibosheth had been injured when he was a little kid, so he actually had a physical handicap. He was not in great shape. And um, he was very nervous. Shh, shh, shh. He was very nervous to come to the castle and see King David because he thought, like everybody thought, he was going to his death, right? It's okay. It's okay. We're being, we're telling the kids at home to be kind, right? So she's just putting the scripture together. Yeah, she's showing us I how to do it. Scripture. Let us spur one another. Let us consider how we may spur one another toward love and good deeds. Oy. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. You got it. Okay, so he actually brought him there and he said, guess what, Mephibosheth? Uh, your daddy was my very best friend in the entire world. So I want to take care of you. I'm going to restore to you everything that belonged to your daddy. And, you're, and I'm going to take care of you. And you're going to live in the castle for the rest of your life. And he did. Can you believe that? Crazy. Wow. So crazy, right? But he was kind to Mephibosheth. That's, that was the whole point. And so what I want you guys to do. You, you good? Okay. We have a few extra pieces, huh? I'm going to try and build a tower. Uh, I think those go in there somewhere, but we'll figure that part out. So what I want you guys to do is I want you to throw kindness around like confetti. Ooh, let's see if we can get it to go, huh? Woo! That was fun, huh? <laughs> throw kindness around like confetti everywhere that you go. That's right. I want you to throw kindness around. Make everybody have kind days and fun days at your house okay it's easy to do all you have to do is be kind now sissy since she did take one of the blocks that she was playing with can she have one back now there we go that's kind yay we love kindness so why don't you go somewhere today uh in your house and you tell or treat somebody with some kindness huh Sh throw kindness around like confetti Mommy, like can david did again I, it's, that was it. It was a one-time shot. Hopefully it's not a one-time shot at your house, though. Okay, huh? Here you go. I'll throw it on your head. There we go. Whee! Whee! There's no more confetti. There's no more confetti. Okay, let's say goodbye to the kids at home. What did we learn? What did we learn today? What did we learn? Kindness. That's right. Throw kindness around like what? Like confetti. Confetti. Just like David and? Mephibosheth. Mephibosheth. That's right. 
Okay, let's say okay bye. Ready? One, two, three. Okay, bye.